What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome to another FIFA 23 video. Today we're going to be testing out the brand new Moments Richarlison and giving my opinion on whether or not he's worth the 450,000 coins required to play for him. But what we're going to do today is going to be a little bit different. We're going to take three games with this Richarlison in the uh, Team of the Year Cup mode and test him out in the team that we've got, which I'll show you in a second. And then afterwards we're going to take two games for the ones to watch Richarlison and give a little bit of feedback on the different feel between the two different versions of the same player to, again, give a bit of an understanding as to whether it's worth it or whether it might even just be worth going and purchasing uh, a Richarlison off the market. You know, he's got the World Cup one on there that's about 300,000 coins right now. So what I like about this card in general is his physicals are great. Of course, he's got four-star skill with five-star weak foot that is absolutely brilliant. He's got good pace, good shooting. Dribbling's not the best, but great physicals, and we are going to be playing a Hawk on him. Now, don't worry about the chem style or the stats at the moment, because we're going to be going into full chemistry mode, which or max chemistry mode, which will give him the full chemistry boost. And he has got the flare trait, the outside the foot shot trait, and the power header trait. Now, the interesting thing about this Richarlison is it's a plus two on the 88, but it's only got plus one in all of the in-game stats. So it's possible he might get a little upgrade extra at some point in the near future that would be absolutely fantastic this is the team we're playing him in that's right as i said it's max kembo so we've got pope in goal trippier at right back sergio ramos is a special card at center back with team of the year van dyke and cap de villa at left back we're going to be playing gareth bale over on the left cam spot in a 4-2-3-1 with Vieira, whoa and alonso as cdms sadio mané will be our right cam team of the year and bappe will be our central cam and richarlison will be our striker so let's get into some games see how he plays our first opponent is rooney tunes let's see what tv he's got everyone's gonna have the same team aren't they it's gonna be like a couple of team of the years and then just loans or like sbc sorry damn and dyke loan is his team of the year let's get it here we go here is richarlison passing awful as his power shots bangs it oh if i would have greened that richarlison shot it would have gone in defeat Oh, I don't like his passing, man. I know it's like part of the like a bad part of the card as well as the passing, but oh yeah, he does feel super agile, super agile. Let's go. Yeah, do you know what? Once we got him on the ball there, that might be game over for game one as well. Yeah, it's going to be game over for game one. Once we got him in the ball, like that was the first proper chance I had to actually get the ball into his feet and have a run with him. And when I did that step over, it was a true test of how is he going to feel. And although his dribbling stats aren't the best and we've got a hawk on him, it was very nice. The pace burst in, the step over, the shot was finally good after a bad first shot. That's game one done. Let's hope we don't get too many rage quits. I want to test him out. All right, team two, the Liverpool Reds. Wait, wasn't the other guy called Man United somethings? Team of the year Courtois. Icons, icons. More icons. Team of the year, Modric, Kent and Salah. Oh, damn. But better passes of the ball still make that pass. All the way through the middle. Oh, he's lightning fast. He's lightning fast and he's got a finish on him. He is lightning fast. Great day. Bale. on the volley bangs it Whoppa! let's go richarlison with the volley of dreams i tried to green it and i couldn't off oh, do i forget to go into like the formation i wanted there it is there it is oh big save courtois is that him there yeah it is richarlison bangs it awful awful oh here he goes richarlison Oh, he's magic, isn't he? He's bad. He's bad. That's my bad. I tried to be too nonchalant with it. Try to just like walk it in and out, but this is where he excels, isn't it? I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Pedriff! Come on, record. Yeah, get him off. Wait, who's he injured? Oh, he injured himself. <laughs> oh. Sending off and an injury. Unlucky, pal. Laurent Blanc got injured. 
I think because Richardson broke his ankles, didn't he? Sometimes you just got Penenka in you. Oh. oh no, he saved it. Oh no. Oh no. What's this guy got? He's got the lone De Bruyne, Bale. Loads of icons again, man. I wonder if people even recognise it. it's like Max Chem mode. Because why would you play with a team where you can play with anyone that you've got? Maybe these are the players they want to play with. Gareth Bale. Let's go. Oh my days. He's actually put that in the back of the net. That's unbelievable. That was a horrible, horrible angle for me to shoot from. All right. So, after the first three games with this Richarlison, zero goals. Oh, they don't count, do they, in that game mode? Lol. Um, it didn't feel like he's worth 450,000 coins, that's for sure. Um, obviously, does a player ever feel like they're worth 450,000 coins? I would say so, because Mbappe feels like different breed. Um, Richarlison definitely feels nice, but I honestly think that it's the sort of thing where that Broha or not whoever that most recent um, SBC was from La Liga, I reckon you'd get a very very similar output. Who was it? Maybe it wasn't La Liga. Who was that striker that we got very recently? Bore, that's the one. I feel like someone like Bore would be very akin to this Richarlison and I know that there'd be some Richarlison fans out there that say like that's crazy or whatever but similar dribbling probably better to a degree similar pace and shooting similar physicals he just doesn't have the four star five star but what we're going to do is as I said we're going to put a different Richarlison in and have a little feel for what this Richarlison is differently so he's got three less pace, three less shooting, three less passing, two less dribbling, three less defending, and two less physical. Now, I do understand that this Richarlison is not on the market. He was an SP, uh, he was an objective, right? Um, however, it's more to try and get an understanding and a read of, is it worth 450k for the SBC Richarlison? And I'll tell you what we're going to do as well. We're going to take out Mbappe. We'll pop him on the bench. Why not? In fact, let's start Mbappe just here. Um, we are actually going to play Bore. And... I haven't used this guy yet, but I'm interested in him. So we'll play Bore in behind uh, Richarlison, and we'll uh, we'll see how this goes. Is Bore? Richarlison finally scores a goal. I've decided, guys, after just one game with this Richarlison, that I don't want to play another game with this Richarlison. The question of is 90 Richarlison worth 450,000 coins? I think is the answer is no. The question is, is he better than the a different version of himself? Yes. That 86 for Charleston is just awful. Let's give the 90 one last game and see how he plays. Oh, Richarlison on. Well, really yeah, definitely, definitely not a 450,000 coin player. Oh, he's... He was not offside. He was not offside. Sorry, but there's no chance. That's where Charleston's a beast. That's where he's a beast. That straight line speed, especially off of a skill move, very good. I think that was TBD of Van Dijk who just absolutely obliterated for pace there. Lovely. All right, he's turned up. He turned up. He's not bad. He, he, I'm glad I came back to the uh, to the 90 rated. Um, and had one more game with him because I got a bit of a better feel for how he should be playing and the strength and pace burst that he showed for the first goal and especially the second goal is exactly what you want. Do I think it's a 450k player still? Absolutely not. Uh, I probably, and unless I'd done every SBC that's left on FIFA and was still getting duplicate fodder, I just wouldn't do this. This is good. That heel-to-heel -heel flick and acceleration boost against Team of the Year Van Dyke, and then the five-star weak foot finish comes in trumps, right? Or, or just having the ability on a five-star weak foot to go left foot or right foot. It's just great. That is just the way he accelerates there. And then the strength here. He is getting bumped left, right, and center by Lothar Mateus. Fights him off. He had a few battles before. Fought them off. And that's what you want from a guy with insanely high physicals. It's exactly what you need. Um... And then this last goal here. I mean, again, the strength to hold off the defender there and a great finishing at the near post. He really shouldn't be scoring that. So the the, the question of 
Should you waste your fodder on uh, Ritalison, right? Um, should you spend that 450k? I think the answer is evidently no. I wouldn't go out of my way, is what I'd, I'd say, to complete this SBC. I wouldn't go out of my way to complete it. However, if you're grinding up great packs, if you've got a lot of fodder from doing S you know, other SBCs and stuff, and you've finished all the other players, then maybe uh, I'd do him. But otherwise, it isn't. I don't think if you don't do this Richarlison, I don't think you're going to be one of those ones that you're missing out on, that you look back on in time and think to yourself, damn, I wish I did him. This is not one of those ones. Um, but anyway, that's going to be the end of the video. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. I'm out. Peace.